Hi guys, I'm Nikki and welcome to my mini resistance band workout. Now today's video is only one of a series of videos where I will show you how to get the most out of your mini resistance band workouts by challenging every part of our body. But in today specifically, we'll be working the chest and the arms to get them nice, toned and strong. So if you are new to this channel, make sure that you hit the subscribe button and the notification bell so that you don't miss any of my future workout videos. Let's get into it. Okay, so throughout this routine, we'll be doing two sets of each exercise, 40 seconds on with a 20 second rest. And in the rest period, as always, I'll show you what the next exercise will be. So the first one is crawling out into a push up. So we're keeping the band around our forearms and we are going to walk out, do a push up, and then crawl back to all fours, keeping our back leg at a 90 degree angle, okay? So we're crawling out, push up, walk it back. Let's go. And walk it back. Keep the core nice and tight. Walk it out. Push up. And back. Good. Now make sure when you walk it out, try and keep the tension in the band at all times. And the more tension in the band, the more that you're working those arms, okay? So out, push up, and back, and rest. 20 seconds rest, shake off those arms. And we'll go again in 10 seconds. Let's go. Now, if you are struggling to do full push-ups, when you walk it out, it's fine to drop down to your knees, push up, and then walk it backwards a little bit. You'll still get a stretch. So walk it out, push up, keep the core nice and tight, and then walk it back in. rest it off good next exercise then we'll be doing a bicep curl so grab your band in fact I'm going to switch bands for this one I'm going to up it a little bit grab your band wrap it around your thigh and then you're going to pull the band up and back down okay so let's pull really keep that tension in the bicep muscle as you're pulling it off and keep the movement slow controlled as well and then slowly lower it back down so pull up and back down up back down good halfway keep moving such a beautiful day today keep going up and down up and down Brill. So now let's swap legs and we'll do the opposite arm. So let's go in three, two, one. Pull up and back down. Up and back down. Up and down, good. Keep it moving, good job so far. Get those biceps nice and strong, halfway. Ten seconds left. Three, 
two, one. Excellent. Okay, so the next exercise we'll do is a lateral bear crawl. To do this exercise, again, don't be afraid to switch up your bands throughout, guys. Some of the exercises require more tension. So, on all fours, we're going out to the left, back to the center, and to the right, back to the center. Let's go. Keep your back legs at a 90 degree angle. Keep the core nice and engaged. Step it out to the right, center, left, center. Good. Okay. Two, and one, rest it off, keep those arms a circle and we'll go again in a few seconds. I'm going to change direction actually because my hands going on the gravel isn't ideal, so. Okay, we'll go again in three, two and one. So we're going out to the left and then back to the centre, to the right, to the centre. Keep those back legs 90 degrees, keep the core nice and tight, keep moving. Good. Keep moving. Excellent. Okay. Next, in fact, we're still on the floor for this one. So, we're doing a plank push-up with banded arms. So keep the art band around the arms. Stay on your knees. Or you can do four, four push-ups if you prefer. We're taking it out to the left. Push-up. Centre. And out to the other side. Let's go. Good. Push up. Centre. Keep the core engaged. Get that chest working. And the arms. Five, four, three, two, one. Rest it off. Okay, we'll go again in five seconds. Catch your breath back. Let's go. Keep working. Good. Halfway. Ten seconds left. And one. Excellent. We are back onto our feet now for the next one and we will be chest pressing. Again, you're probably gonna to need to up your resistance band for this one. And hold your band around one shoulder and then press it out with the same arm, okay? So let's go. Push it out, back in, out and back in. And as you're doing it, make sure that you Really feel that tension in the chest muscle as you pull it out. Push it out even. So push it out. Tense that chest. Keep the core engaged. And keep pushing. Good. Really feel that chest muscle working. Four, three, 
two, one, and rest it off, change arms. So wrap it around the shoulder, and then we're gonna push it out and in. So let's go in five, four, three, two, one, and push. Push. Good. So important to work the chest. A lot of people neglect the chest, which means that you're going to struggle with push ups a lot more. So don't neglect the chest, make sure that you do exercise it just as much as you do the glutes and the legs and all the other fun parts. But the chest is just as important for all around you strength. So keep pushing. Excellent, rest. Okay, so next, last exercise, we are doing tricep extension. So for your tricep extension, again, swap, swap arms, Keep it around your shoulder, and then what you're going to do is press down and up. So you can see that tricep muscle really working. Let's go. Push it down and up. That's it. Up. And to get more of a stretch, just hold it at the bottom for a second, and then slowly lift it back up. So push down, hold, back up. Good. And you should feel that stretch in that bicep muscle. If you can't feel it, then do up the resistance band. Good. Keep going. Two and one. Good. I'm going to push it up for this last set. Let's go for it. Three, two, one. Let's go. Keep pushing. Push and up. Push it down and back up. Good. Keep going. Only a few seconds left. Keep on pushing. Three, two, and one. Excellent. We are finished. So, I hope you've enjoyed that one as well. If you haven't checked out the rest of the resistance band series, then make sure you do because I'm working all over the body. And if you enjoyed that workout, then make sure you give it a big thumbs up. Make sure you smash that subscribe button and the notification bell so that you don't miss any future work workouts that I upload. And I'll look forward to seeing you in my next video. See you.